Welcome to Bet Online All Access. I'm Ali Melendez. Now, the boys of summer are buzzing. Of course, I am talking about our baseball players. We have reached the halfway mark for Major League Baseball. It has been such a whirlwind of a season. Here now to make sense of some of the craziness happening this season. And of course, what we can predict in the second half is our very own Drew Butler. Drew, how's it going? Yeah, it's going great, Allie. You just mentioned it. Basketball's over, hockey is over, so the summertime is officially in full swing. And baseball is what we got over at Bet Online. And with the halfway point, the All Star break right around the corner, right here. I think yeah. it's kind of time to take account of what has happened in the first half of the season and check out the futures board and what's to come in the second half of the MLB baseball season. Exactly, a lot to break down, like you said. So let's take a look at what has already happened with the first half and some of the teams that you want to talk about leading into the second half because there's been so many changes between our predictions going into the season and where we are now and I would imagine there's going to be a lot more as we head into the second half. Yeah, there's no question and one division that I really have my eyes on right now is the American League East. Obviously, the Tampa Bay Rays, who had the best start ever of any baseball team in Major League history, they're still at the top, but you see how they've been trending coming up towards the All-Star break. They're kind of reverting back to the mean just a little bit, and I see a great value play for a future of a division winner in the AL East, and it's none other than the New York Yankees. That's right. Get this. All five teams in the AL East are in the positive in run differential, led by the Rays plus 146 in run differential. That's crazy. I don't think it's sustainable. The Yankees are plus 22. Can Tampa Bay sustain that throughout the second half? No. And this is common territory for the New York Yankees. Executive Brian Cashman came out weeks ago and said to the fans, why are you so worried? It's only May. It's only June. There's a lot of baseball left. When you have Aaron Judge, Anthony Rizzo, Torres, pitchers like Garrett Cole and Clark Schmidt, Look, I think the value here on the New York Yankees, just about 10, 9, 8 games behind the Tampa Bay Rays right now, take it and run with it. The New York Yankees are going to win the AL East. Ooh, and you're usually right, so I'm going to double down <laughs> on this with you as a New Yorker. I'm liking everything that I'm hearing. So obviously, like you said, a lot more baseball to be played all after All-Star break. Yeah, All-Star break is going to be a great time for these teams to kind of tank account uh, and see how they're going to attack the second season. You said you're a New Yorker. What are the New York Mets going to do? I have no idea. Steve Cohen, he's already showing support for Buck Showalter. Will that last? We're going to find out, but teams will make trades. They're going to pick and choose how they're going to attack the second season. Some may even pack it in due to injuries and say, you know what, we're looking towards 2024. But a team that I think is going to go all in, and it's because of how they've been playing, Allie, are the Texas Rangers. And that's my pick right now for my World Series future. The Texas Rangers are plus 152 in run differential. That's the best across Major League Baseball. And the AL West has four out of the five teams in the positive for the run differential. And the Rangers are more than 100 runs better than the second place Angels. Another thing I love about the Texas Rangers, their manager, Bruce Bochy, three-time World Series champion. He knows how to get it done, led by Corey Seager. Texas has some of the best position players across the entire league. This team is stacked. More importantly, they're consistent. Another great value play here, the Texas Rangers to win the World Series right now at the Bet Online Futures Board. Wow, you seem extremely confident in your decision there and your choice there. But what about some long shots? I mean, like I said before, we had the Mets coming out of the gate amazing. Yeah. Now it's like, ugh, right? So what are some teams that we can focus on that might do it the opposite way and kind of take what they have, be amazing toward the end of the season and surprise us when it comes yeah. toward the time of playoffs? Absolutely. I think one of the most surprising teams in all of Major League Baseball right now are the Cincinnati Reds. What a story. They just are fresh off a 12-game win streak. And here's another one of my futures, okay? The Cincinnati Reds, to make the playoffs, like I said, they are one of the most exciting teams to watch in baseball and one of the most unexpected storylines throughout the first half of the Major League season. And Ellie De La Cruz, a rookie that they called up earlier in June, has been absolutely on fire. The National League Central is largely bunched right around that 500 mark. You can consider it mediocrity if you want to. But I think the Reds, with their juice, their youth, and really how they've been playing a lot of streaky baseball, 
they're going to make the playoffs. I think that's a great way to look at a team that could catch fire again in the second half and really make some noise. Cincinnati is a great baseball city as well. And Alexis Diaz, Edwin's younger brother. Edwin, of course, he's injured this year for the New York Mets. Alexis has turned in one of the best closers in all of baseball. And we all know how important bullpen pitching is when you're trying to make the playoffs. So I love the Cincinnati Reds. True. Thank you so much. We always appreciate having you on, having the insight. You are incredible. And like you said, a lot more baseball to be played. I look forward to all of the action. Well, friends, that wraps up this edition of Bet Online All Access. If you're watching on our YouTube channel, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And hey, drop us a line. Why not? We'd love to hear from you. Enjoy all of the baseball, and be sure to get all of your MLB futures, odds, and info at Bet Online. Bet Online, where the game starts.